Hey there again, folks. Welcome back to the Real Long Walk. And by Real Long Walk, I mean let's hop in a boat and not walk anywhere. Hopefully, there'll be some more land pretty soon. I do. Oh my. My, my microphone is coming loose. Uh oh. I kind of totally don't have my webcam just propped up on the bottom of my monitor on top of a book with really really weird tape well not weird tape but but some sort of a tape <laughs> uh, I don't know I know that the tape is yellow and it stinks like everything so it might be tape from the 1970s that I'm uh, using to keep my microphone on the uh, sort of in place. I probably don't have it optimally set up. I've always had it to where it, the 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 uh, the cord from the microphone from the webcam is coming over my, my uh, just slightly to the side of a mouse. It's actually not a it's not a very super long cord. Though it might, <clears throat> might be enough to go behind the desk and, oh hey, this is one. I can go behind the desk and into the back of the computer, but I'm just, I don't like to keep my microphone plugged in. Well, I don't like to keep my webcam plugged in. I'm just, I just don't like to do that. Uh, so yeah. Always unplug it uh, when I when I get done recording or, or talking on Skype. I'm gonna have to get some more tape though. I think in order to fix that, I haven't even used this as a webcam here lately. Though I need to. I need to. I've been talking about. Are, and, and are thinking about doing an update video and I just have not done it I need to do an update video I really do I've been I have been doing I keep forgetting you can, you can actually walk over beds in the new version okay good I'm going in the right direction I didn't even think to check that uh, bleh. Yeah, I've been back to uh, being better about doing YouTube videos here lately. Ooh, that's the deep hole. Got Bioshock back on the uh, back on the rails. I've got this going up pretty steady. Got Bingo. Got I'm I'm about to be getting some uh, episodes, some videos of uh, of uh. Some uh, gameplay that I've done with the gatekeepers. There'll be some of them videos going up. We've uh, we played some speedrunners, some uh, Gary's mod, some Minecraft. So yeah, I'm, I'm going to be getting some videos of them up there too, and I hope we. I'm sure we will continue to be making videos. Uh, I've there for a while while I was feeling bad. I kind of just was keeping to myself, that sort of thing. But I've been been trying to get back into the 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 multiplayer gaming more than I was. So uh, I've been I've been enjoying myself. Hopefully, hopefully they've been enjoying having me there. Hopefully I'm. Not too crazy. It is something that I've uh, that I wonder sometimes. I know a lot of people. A lot of people. Uh, they talk about people overreacting in YouTube videos, your your horror games, and that sort of thing. And I, I worry sometimes whether or not. Whether or not people might think that's me, I, I just 
it's very weird how how my brain works, I guess. Now, I am definitely overly paranoid. But I am very easily distracted, and I guess that kind of explains it. I get really involved in in something. I get thinking. I'm focused, sort of. And then if something happens that I'm not expecting it, I do tend to to react pretty strongly. I mean, I've actually told you several times that you, that you don't need to play horror games. Just just put Minecraft in UHC mode and go caving. You see a creeper, you're gonna scream. You see you see a zombie jump, uh, drop down on your head. You you might just scream. <laughs> Or right, that's me anyway. I'm focused on trying not to die and doing something, and then suddenly something jumps out, and yeah. Yeah, that's something I'm something that I'm somewhat paranoid about. I, I'm sure that most of the folks I play with don't, you know, aren't, you know, don't think that. But I'm. I let myself think things. Hopefully, it, hopefully it doesn't it doesn't bother anybody. I've I've always, you know, thought, you know, folks don't have to watch anything that might annoy them, you know. So if they ever do do that, just just quit watching. That's that's a terrible way to market yourself. Yeah, guys. If, uh, if if I bother you, just just quit watching. Yeah, that'll, that's totally a great way to to put yourself out there. By the way, I'm not feeling much more awake than I did last time uh, in the last uh, real long walk. Uh, I had some. I did have some trouble with my stomach last night. I wound up. I actually tried to record this earlier. Uh, in like, uh, what time was it? About two in the morning, and I got about a minute in. And I was like, "Whoop, gotta run!" <laughs> and uh, it kept me awake for a while. After that, so uh, yeah, that's uh, that's my morning for you. We are getting more land now. That is nice. That is very nice. Progress is slowing down a little bit, but that's fine. Better to have things to to explore and look at while we're while we're going to the edge of the world rather than nothing and making much faster progress. Wow. You know, I actually meant to Jump on one of them lily pads. That was terrible. Yeah, I was saying earlier, I really do need to do a uh, an update video to, to help to help update you know update uh, folks. I know everybody don't watch the same videos, you know. Some uh, you know people watch some Minecraft videos. Some of them don't. Uh, so yeah, I need to. I need to do that. I really do. I need to shave too. That's not why I haven't done the update video, but I have been thinking. You know what? I could wait until I shaved. I could go ahead and do that. Wait till I get a haircut too. Yeah, just wait, don't 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 go Wait until you don't look like a hobo to do an update video. Hey guys, here's an update video. I am now living from the backs of trains. Hop in a train car, ride into the next city. When I get to the next city, gonna do here here's the videos we're gonna do. 
do some Bioshock. We're going to keep on with uh, the really long walk. Yeah, you know, uh, ignore, please ignore the, the sound of the engine chugging. That's constant background noise. Actually, there are a lot of trains that pass through here. I don't, I don't think they're ever detectable on camera or through the microphone, but there are a lot that come through. Especially in the middle of the night. I think there's a good four or five that I hear every single night come, come through. I mean, they're not, they're not super close to the house, but they're somewhat close. Can definitely hear them. If they were, if it was any closer, it probably would be detectable through the microphone. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's at least three or four, maybe even five. Might be a different number each night too, so. But you know, it's always nice, you know. Let's try to sleep. Then hear a train horn. Is it a horn? That trains whistle. Whistle. It's it's a whistle. It doesn't really sound like a whistle though. It's it sounds more like a horn. Yeah, we're definitely having a lot more of these planes than we were. Wonder, wonder if it was going to the nether that solved this. That seems silly, but I wonder if it was. Ooh, I, I could use some more wool. Let's keep the wool topped out. So if you if you have been watching my Bioshock series, hopefully you're gonna start seeing some uh, some quality go up with it. I have had trouble with action in the past of uh, getting the the recording software action to to uh, record properly or even start up. A lot of times when I try to start it up, it'll uh, It'll just, it'll just not work, and the pop-up will stay on the computer and will not go away. It won't start up all the way. Uh, I can't remember exactly what it does, but I know I've tried Control Alt Delete to end it. That doesn't work, and you know if Control Alt Delete don't work, then whoa, there's a there's a problem. Houston, there there may just be a problem. So, uh, no, I don't think I'm going to need this. I have too much inventory right now. So, yeah, I've just had a lot of trouble just getting it to work. And then, not just that, but get it to work properly. 54, yeah. Uh, I know with my Fallout series, I, I recorded, had to record the same thing two or three times. And, uh, that got frustrating. For, for one episode, and then tried another one, and, uh, crash, burn, anger. Many feelings like that. So yeah, I, I do know know that a lot of people have had good luck with it, and hopefully, I'm going to start having much better luck with it. Uh, I noticed a setting that that popped up the other night. It was when uh. Yeah, it was when I recorded Vanguard Princess. I had to, I had to use action in order to uh, to record that. 
because I had to use a screen screen capture because it was undetectable by any other software as a game you know so I had to you know click here drag here to capture everything in here screen capture like that uh, and it, it worked and I went back and looked at the video for Vanguard Princess and the frame rate was all jacked up the game was looking way sluggier sluggisher sluggy sluggier slower than it was when I was actually playing it so I was like well that sucks so I went into the settings which I had made sure to say uh, 30 frames per second because uh, I had something I learned when I was doing Fallout 3 because if you have it at 60 frames per second it will it will make you it will make your audio out of sync. It'll record fine for five minutes, and then all of a sudden, uh, it'll be like, I'm going to swing my sword right now. Die, creature, die, die, die. <laughs> like that right there. Only a bit more delay, I think. Which, uh, which pissed me off. Obviously, because... You know, I did a test recording. Everything seemed fine, and then, I, but I didn't do a five-minute plus test recording was the problem. I had to go on the forums and search and find out that it was actually that setting that did that. Uh, so I rechecked that, made sure that that setting was proper, and I saw a setting that said uh, something like uh, 30 frames per second AMD. I was like. AMD. Well, let's try that. The frame rate, the frame rate worked properly that time. Maybe it's a driver. Maybe it, maybe an update with action. You know, it's figured out that I have an AMD video card and downloaded a driver that would work more proper with it. Because that video worked out fine, and I uh, loaded up uh, action and played, uh, did a video of Bioshock yesterday, and it it looked good. It actually looked, looked like it recorded well. Uh, the, the The program didn't crash. Didn't have to restart my computer in order to shut down the program, or to make my computer think the program was done. Like that, like has happened. So maybe I can start getting more use out of action, which would be nice because I spent fifty freaking dollars on that program. That's why. That's why it's really annoying to spend money on software. Okay, oh, I didn't. Because a lot of times it just don't work. That's why I tend to avoid it a lot of times. That's why I'm, I've got something that works like Fraups. Kind of tentative to make it or, or, to, or to make any changes, but, but yeah, I think it's gonna start working good for me. That's what I'll use for for Bioshock and probably a lot more of my actiony type stuff. I'll probably keep using Fraps for for Minecraft because of habit. Though so I might switch over eventually. I do one thing I do like about action is it tells you how long you've been recording. Fraps don't tell you. And I couldn't tell you how long I've been recording. I do that so often. I'll, uh... I know the last episode, I would have actually wrapped it up sooner if I had known that it wasn't... like, 15 minutes long. I had, uh, I had a little bit of trouble with, uh... coming up with stuff to say and... 
and, you know, and I wind up uh, blundering about talking about One Piece. Um, and that was it was about it. 15, 20 minutes in, so I could have just ended the episode pretty soon after that. I, I would like to find a a you know I really don't know how long to make these. Ooh, oh, that's cool. See, I always love finding my oh. You, Oh, sheep, come on, play ball with me. Oh, come on. Oh. Actually, I need to be careful. They could push me in. <laughs> they could push me in if I'm not careful. You always like finding my shafts uh, in the ravines. They just look cool that way. There's a spider spawner that's pretty safe there, though. Thankfully, the sun's out. It wouldn't be very safe. Whoa. Whoa. Wouldn't be very safe if the sun wasn't out. Yeah, I need to find a, a more... Um, a good length of these episodes. Because I just tend to... They, they tend to be just random lengths. Some of them be be just over twenty. Some will go thirty. I've had some go up to like. I think one was forty five minutes, maybe. <laughs> Where I just didn't realize that I needed to shut up and in the episode, or may have had something something incredible to say during it. really don't have that bad of music. It's more serene than uh, than a lot of music in games. Which I guess I guess it fits it though, you know, you play Minecraft kinda of to relax. To chill. So I guess it really does fit pretty well. I think this is probably a pretty good uh, bit to end it on. I think because I honestly don't know how long I've been recording. Maybe I should go and switch over to action uh, for uh, for these, so I can know how long the episodes are. I have a terrible sense of of time, I guess you could say. So yeah, uh, so yeah, I do sincerely hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, be on the lookout for some new videos coming out uh, with the gatekeepers. I, I mentioned that I can't remember if I went into much detail. Yeah, I think I did. Speedrunners, Gary's Mod, Minecraft. Yeah, I did say that, didn't I? Yep, yep, yep. Well, there you go. A second reminder then. I do sincerely hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Farewell.